Hey guys, I hope that you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more RimWorld. Royalty. And Bloodbound is just getting breakfast set up here. as uh, 2 in the morning. And uh, yeah, we're just waiting. We don't really have a whole lot going on right now. But we are in the process of recruiting Blitz here. Um, he is well on his way, and Bloodbound is getting to work on uh, breaking or building up this little perimeter wall around our farm so these freaking animals quit eating all our plants. Uh, admittedly, I don't think they really are, but... Can never be too safe, right? Let's go ahead and speed three it until everybody else gets up. I think they usually get up around six o'clock. Having a quick sleeper is, is quite a good thing, honestly. This construction's already up to seven. If I recall correctly, this one, the construction started at a four, so. Oh, they actually changed the door sound, too. Doors are a lot less loud in your face now. So, Palmer, what have you been doing, Palmer? Instead of constructing? I don't know. Everyone eating their breakfast. And this all helps out their mood, you can see here. Yeah, his bonded animal died, but like... Um, they prefer to eat breakfast at a table. That's what I'm looking for, but I can't find it, but that's fine. All right, cool. So as far as construction projects goes, we definitely are going to be needing to get to it. Um, also going to need to haul some of these rocks. So long as all these there's rocks in this pile, Bloodbound will get some of that done. So that's great. And this is our little workshop area. Admittedly, we're going to end up needing to uh, change stuff up a bit, but for now, we're fine. I'm not too concerned about it for now. We still have enough slate to finish up these walls, so that's good. Very good. Take those down. And uh, let's put you there, and then you there. Let's go ahead and build a copy right here for this guy, and then a copy here for that guy. That way we have some cover on both sides. Our shooters can shoot here and our melee guys can run around. We'll build up when we can. Oh, no, no, no. Oopsies. Uh, no roof area over the plants, you silly gooses. Take it down. Take it down. There we go. Minor break risk and bloodbound. What's going on with you, brother? Chemical desire, unsightly environment, sweaty. Oh, come on now. All of our rice plants are done. Oh, wow. Well, that's unfortunate. All right, let's cut all those plants. Luckily, it won't spread to my other plants, which is nice. So they changed that. It used to be a blight for everything. And then it would just randomly spread throughout. So I'm glad that it's just rice plants. Jaren can handle that in the morning. Food-wise, we're we're fine. We're not gonna we're not gonna be go starving or anything because of that. Oh no, it is spreading. Ah, okay, hold on. Hold on a second. Jeez, oh Pete. I spoke too soon. Bloodbound or Jaren. Cut those plants, dang it. I don't want it to spread anymore. Come on, don't rest, man. You don't need to rest. Rest is for the week. No, we're losing our cotton. Oh, this is bad. I really want this cotton here. Come on now. Go do it. Dang it, man. All right, Jaren. Now you're starting to get on my nerves, man. Go cut all these plants. It's morning time, you need to do this. Let's actually go ahead and say... Um, everybody wakes up at five, works, or recreates from five to six. Five hour shift. Do whatever you want for two hours. Six hour shift. Play games, go to bed. That sounds good to me. Man, this is driving me crazy. 
Let's make ah, uh, all this cotton is getting wasted now. Um, dude, oh my gosh, it's spreading everywhere. All right, Jaren, what are you doing, dude? No, you will not be cloud watching. That is absolutely not what you're going to be doing. Uh, not drop plus steel knife. Come on now. What is this guy here? Cotton plant? I'm getting so annoyed about all these plants getting blighted. I want you to plant cut. There we go. Cut and all right, he's eating now. Ay ay ay. All right, he'll do all of it now. Goodness gracious. What an unfortunate happening here, huh? Yeah, we'll make it work. It's fine. All we lost was food. We lost a bit of cotton, but not a whole lot. Go cut those, please. Jaren? Nope, no, 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 no. You? Go do that. Thank you. Nope. You will cut it all off and then you will get back to work. There you go. Now you can do whatever you want, brother. Okay. Take a sip of my coffee here while everybody's working. Oh, we got a raid. The nation of Bredasia. All right, group of tribes people. Pair of defense. So it's just Tiger here. I'm loving the new music. Good crafting and good cooking. You wouldn't be do it worthless. So you could be crafting, cooking, and then intellectual. I like that. So Palmer's over here doing their dang thing. So let's also say Bloodbound, when you're not cutting rocks, you're going to be doing some tailoring. Actually, I think you should be doing some tailoring at all times, but I assume we don't have it right now in our... Uh, or is he getting to work on it right now? Yeah, he is. Very cool. Making that duster. Okay, so... Who are my shooters? Jaren, I'm gonna move you... over there. Right-click to move that, in case you didn't know. That way I can grab my shooters in one foul swoop there. Okay, very cool. I was Blitz coming along. Still 5.4. Palmer's getting all of our things set up, so that's good. So, looks like uh, Tiger's on his way. So let's go ahead and get you guys over here. Everybody's set up. Should be pretty quick. Um, let's actually have you guys, like, switch places right there. There we go. Should be pretty straightforward. He wants to run around the wall. Oh, he got hit. And he's hit. Got hit in the shoulder. All right, he's done. Okay. Didn't even make it all the way out. Very good. Don't really want the steel steel knife, but I will take the psychite T. There we go. Cool. Very good. That wasn't too bad at all. Admittedly, once we get our smithing done, we'll be able to get Clampet a uh, take Clampet a good a better weapon, a gooder weapon. I do want you to go ahead and clean up this room. Thank you. He will appreciate being in a room that's not so ugly. All right. I'm not sure what Palmer's doing. Just chilling. And then. Uh, Bloodbound will get up nice and early. Oh yeah, look how fast their rest goes up compared to the other ones. Some visitors. Pact of Galga. So you got Nicole, Exaxo, Love, Love Zaxos, and uh, Condor. Love Zaxos, how are you doing? What do you have to sell me? Some drugs. Royal sh sheep wool royal robe. Can I actually see that on you? Nope. They're not wearing it because they're tribes people and they prefer to wear the tribal clothing. All right, well, let's take a look here with Bloodbound, see what you guys got for us. 
So, cloth, component, package survival meals. We can sell them the two knives since I don't want them anymore. Um, I'll keep the synth red pants. They'll be useful later on. So, uh, I guess we'll just make six, six silver off of you and we're good to go. But uh, now you can go recruit Blitz. At least get some of his uh, resistance down a bit. Hopefully it goes down a decent amount, right? Cool. Almost 0.8, so that's good. Okay. I'm excited to see how the first duster comes out. It's good. Let's go ahead and give that to Jaren, since he is going to be our melee dude. It's good that he has a, uh, a jacket. Admittedly, maybe it would be best to have, like, some, uh... No, actually, I think we're good. So we have a transport pod. A house servant named Rebecca. Good cooking, good with animals, incapable of social and intellectual, hypersensitive, but a fast walker. So she would be a good walker, a good animal person. She's got a leg scar, which would kind of negate some of the pain, uh, the slow walker or the fast walker buffs. But uh, cool. Let's go ahead and put a bed right there. Do I have any fast walkers I could grab her? Nope. All right. So who's not doing anything right now? Probably Palmer hauling. So. I'll have you go ahead and go uh, capture her. They left us a gift. Very nice. They left us a Glitter World Medicine. I love that. Thank you. It will come in handy later on. An ancient danger somewhere. Ooh, okay. Well, we know not to touch that anytime soon. Let's hope Palmer can get Rebecca in there and Bloodbound, if you wouldn't mind, uh, who's our doctor? Jay Clampett. Go ahead and get this girl set up. She usually, they don't bleed out on their own, right? Yeah, they're fine. Cool. Well, it's got his peg leg. He's up to 80, 80 movement, which is, is not bad at all compared to what I was expecting it to be. So I'm all right with that. So we need to build her a bed. So she'll be, uh, she won't hate us as much. Um, let's just put it right there, I suppose. We can also go ahead and put a dresser in here. Make everybody a little happier. Very good. There you go. Now if you would go ahead and capture her and put her in her bed. And then if you would go ahead... Ay, 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 I keep hitting the wrong button there. Move this bed down here. Um, let's just have you go ahead and do that. And then also have Palmer come on over here, put her in bed. There we go. Build a dresser that will be shared between the two of them. That will help them sleep a bit better, which will increase their comfort, which is good. Now we just wait. Pretty good. So Rebecca, she's uh, low resistance, so that's good. She would be great for animals. Admittedly, we don't have, we do have some animals out in the wild. Some mufflos would be nice. Bad thing is, is that, uh, we need to bury this guy. Bad thing is, is that when we, uh, excuse me, keep hiccuping, when we are, um, Recruiting multiple prisoners. We also have Multiple bars of food that are going out per night. So might be in our best interest to make a larger growing zone up here with some more rice um, Something like mm, I don't know the corn will be done here within the next couple of days and I think we'll actually be okay Blitz's resistance is almost broken as well so this will be really good. Yes, very nice. So Bloodbound got a duster as well. Very good. Just need one more, but we need the uh, the stuff for it. 
Gaining that building level. Oh, they made it so you don't gain experience. Oh wait, another transport pod. Kerr. Oh my goodness gracious. You are quite, quite the character here. Cooking melee. Who is your, uh, your daughter? Your daughter? Um, oh, Rebecca. No way. Well, totally. I'm just gonna go ahead and, uh, capture him as well. Okay. So let's go ahead and have, uh, Jaren go ahead and grab him. Where's Kerr at? Where's he at? Hello. Oh, there he is. Go ahead and capture him. Mm, go Frenzy. Very nice. I think that increases his global work speed. If I'm... Where does it say? I don't know. Okay. Oh, because we captured him. Now they hate me. I don't care. So he has no resistance. Kerr should be a pretty easy recruit then. Maybe even this time. Very nice. Great. Um, that being said, we're gonna need to make some more bedrooms. So luckily we have a nice little spot in the root in the wall over here. So let's go ahead. We'll leave a little hallway there for sure. Let's go ahead and put like right here. Mine out the rest of that, and we can go ahead and put a, uh, a wall right down the middle there. Oh, wait, I also need a door. There we go. That'll do the trick. Go ahead and build a bed right there and a bed right there. Very good. So let's see here. Welcome, Kerr. I'll rename you in between episodes. So you are now our warden, not our cook. Oh yes, definitely our cook, actually. So you guys can cook, but I would rather you do crafting, cleaning, and hauling. Kerr will do art. If there's no cleaning or hauling to be done, no cooking, no wardening. Don't need to be hunting. So, Bloodbound, you can hunt. There we go. There's a good bed for him, so let's go ahead and set him as the owner. And then, uh, go ahead and smooth this surfaces over here. Not actually mine that out. Let's go ahead and smooth that surface as well. There we go. Cool. All right. The Kerr now has a bed. Low food, yeah. Yeah, that'll happen. All right, well, I suppose maybe it's time we did a little bit of uh, hunting. So let's go ahead and hunt some boar. Almer can go shoot them with the rifle. You just gotta hope that they don't get uh, super mad about it. Sometimes they do. Oh, whoa, was that one shot, one kill? Gunshot bolt action to the neck. All right, sounds good to me. Maybe I shouldn't have bloodbound hunting. Yeah, I take, I take it back. <laughs> bloodbound, you don't have to go hunting anymore. You can go do your thing, man. All that blood from, who was that from again? Actually, I can't remember. It was from the warg we killed, I remember now. Very good. With a, a much better recruiter, it's gonna actually make recruiting a lot easier as well. Even with a low opinion, he still took it down 0.8. So these guys have a high aid relation, so they should be able to uh, be friendly with each other pretty easily. He'll actually be able to make fine meals as well. Let's also go ahead, and this is a little, some, a little trick that some people don't know about. 
If you put stools down, they act as a table. So if the meat is sitting on the table, rather than having to run over and grab it to take it and put it on the stove, they'll just grab it directly out of their, you know, vicinity within arm's length. So definitely going to need some more. Apparently it's going to be pretty cold out. Very good. Resistance from Rebecca is lowering. So our, our colony is growing quite large, quite fast. Hmm. Okay. Where are you at? Here you go. So we hit it. Here we go. It's gonna bleed out even if you don't kill it. No, go grab it, you dingus. Sometimes they do that. I never understand why they like shoot it and then they'll walk away, but it is what it is. Ooh, a raid. Alliance of Oza. Tribes people. They will prepare for a while and then attack. So monkey has an artery blockage. Oh my goodness gracious, you are a sharpshooter who's got a burning passion. All right, well, Curry, you can hang back. We're actually just gonna head on up here and see if we can bait him into attacking us. Um, admittedly, he wouldn't be that useful, but he would be useful um, to shoot and then do research. Like, that that's all he would do. He would be a mule for that. Hit him. There we go. Got one hit. No immediate danger. That's fine. I think it slows him down though, right? Yep. His moving is poor because he got shot in the leg. Very good. All right, let's get you guys out of there. There we go, hit him again. Okay, they killed him. Ah, eh, whatever, that's fine. Cool. To be honest with you, you don't really have the food resources to handle all that anyways. We're very low on the foods. Hmm, might need to actually hunt a few more of the, uh, of the boars. So they're just gonna be in here smoothing this off. Are you guys getting a lot of experience for this? Oh yeah, you are. That's pretty good experience. Interesting. Actually very beautiful as well. Oh, Kerr's sleeping. They're just doing it on top of Kerr. That's awesome. Cool. So, Jaren. Okay, Rebecca is fully healed. I need Jaren to uh, get rid of or to finish up with this this corn. This corn is going to be huge. Corn gives you a lot of a lot more than what you normally would expect from rice. Like, let's say each harvest you get ten, you get like thirty from corn. So it doesn't look like we're getting as much, but we actually are. Okay, so her resistance is almost broken. What's Blitz's resistance at? One more talk and he'll get his resistance will be broken as well, which is great. Let's see here. Just waiting on everybody. Sleepy, sleepy time. Take a sip of my coffee here. I do love me some coffee. First thing in the morning, it's a beautiful thing. All right, Kerr, there we go. Blitz, break that resistance. Yes. Very good. Okay. Cool. They're going to finish up smoothing that. Let's actually go ahead. We're going to need to smooth off these walls as well. Not the floor there. Actually, might as well smooth the floor down, right? And then for the one that won't be smoothed, we'll just put like a piece of concrete under the bed or something. That's fine. This bedroom isn't nearly as important. This will just be for whoever gets recruited next. Probably Rebecca. Definitely gonna need more food though. Should be able to get it started here soon. 
Come on, baby. Yes. Welcome to the... Welcome to the fold, man. Wow. Blitz, you are quite... Quite the character here. So let's actually just have all these guys who can do doctoring do it. Blitz, uh, will Blitz and Kerr will do the cooking. Uh, you'll do it if there is no construction. Growing. Um, let's go with plant cutting. Oh man, Blitz is just such a good character in general. Oh, I really like this music too. Cool. Well, that's a really good place to end the episode, so I hope you guys are enjoying, and if you are, please share your support and leave a like. Subscribe if you have not already and you want to see some more RimWorld action as well as some other games like EU4. And if you want to check out the Discord or support my channel via my Patreon page, get your name on here. The links will be in the description down below. And with all of that being said, this is Chewy Shoot, and I will catch you guys later. A big special thanks to Bloodbound92, Valentel, CWG, Dutch Terror, J Clampett, Yudaldo, Classified for Life, Corbett Gaming, Michael Walker, Palmer, Jonathan Crane, Airborne Animal, and all my other awesome supporters on Patreon. I appreciate you guys. Check out the two series linked on the left and the right, and don't forget to subscribe.